Welcome back to Up the Creek Hockey Cards in what is round six of us ripping the snot out of a case of Series 1, 22, 23. Obviously, we are hunting for, well, we're hunting for anything awesome, but personally, collecting the uh, young guns. We've got so far, no, Boldy, was it Boldy? We got a Berniers, Berniers, and we got a Berniers um, canvas. So that's pretty good. We got the Ottawa Boys, or not Ottawa Boys, <laughs> Buffalo, Buffalo Boys. So we're just going to keep going through. Oh, we're starting out with our French variant of Quinn Hughes. Oh, of all the inserts, I mean, that's probably the one that I'd say scrap, but probably get some backlash from people loving that one. Trevor Zegras, center of attention. Solid card. Don't know what he's how he's been doing this year. I haven't really. I know the team's not really great, but I don't know as far as how he's making up the points. Haven't seen any highlight reels. Okay, we got a clear cut of Chase Pearson. That's our first clear cut we've got. Um, don't know a lot about him. I know he's in Grand Rapids. I haven't seen him up with the the mothership with Detroit, but cool card. Always, always beauty cards. Kind of wish when you snag those can't young guns canvas or clear cuts or whatever it is that they're kind of one of the primo players, but all the same. Nice card. Honor roll of our Temi Panarin. Actually, that one's numbered at a 250. You kind of see it 121 at a 250 right there in the center. We got a flip. Oh. And then we also have a, a Young Guns of Sam F um, Fagamo. Seven games in the AHL this year. I'm not sure if he's been up or will be coming up. Part of that deep, deep Kings prospect pool. We've got a UD canvas of Michael Bunting. Release. Got one of the new inserts, Charlie McAvoy's Defense Mechanism. Kind of cool cards. Uh, I believe there's 50 in that set to collect, I believe. Oh, that's a sweet pick of Stuart Skinner. Haven't seen that one yet. Okay, we've got, I'd say again, another kind of B-grade Young Guns of Nicholas Abruzzisi for the Leafs. I mean, any... Any high-end Leafs, any Leafs or Montreal or big market players, you kind of always hope they kind of pop off a little bit. He hasn't, I don't think he's played any with the Leafs this year. I don't think. But he's got, I think he's got well, almost a point per game down with the Marlies. So that's solid. You'll see him up there with the Leafs at some point. Try to shore up that bottom six. All right, we got Dreisaitl, UD Portraits. So this is box number six. So we are halfway through our case. Uh, Cole Sillinger, rookie retrospective. Don't believe he's really done a whole lot this year. I don't believe he's scored yet this year. Uh, he was my first UD exclusives, Young Guns exclusive I've, I'd ever pulled. He got it last in the Series 2 case. Oh, look at this, Cole Sillinger, UD canvas. Um, it was, it was one of the only cards I got out of that case in series two that was not in good shape. I sent it to, um, quality control. Hopefully, I mean, who knows what you're going to get back. I highly doubt it'll be the same card. We got a Lucas Dostal goaltender, um, playing in the AHL, three wins, four losses, ERA about three and a half. I don't think he's really going to take over Gibson's job anytime soon. I'm, I'm not going to tell you who the backup is there. All right. We got a Karel Vamelka. Dazzlers. Been one of those in each box. I did pull a pink Kopitar Dazzlers in the last box, which is kind of cool. Landeskog. What else we got? Okay. There we go. 
Marco Rossi. We've been waiting for him. He's one of the big boys in this set. Um, hasn't really lit it up. He's got one point this year so far in 10 games. But um, very solid prospect. Um, between, I mean, Minnesota, they've got the, him, and, or him and Matt Boldy. Boldy, to me, is... Oh, there's McJesus portraits. Um, I know Beneers. I said it every time, sorry. But Beneers probably the leader in Calder looks so far. I think at the end of the year, my money's on Boldy. Defense mechanism, Miro Heiskanen. But hard to really make any assumptions here at 10, 12 games into the season. We got Josh Bailey, UD Canvas. We got Mad Sogard. Um, hasn't played this year, but I know well, he's a beast. He's like six foot seven or six foot eight. And I'm pretty sure there's some pretty high hopes for him in Ottawa um, to come in. Says he does have two games with the Senators with a win and a loss. But I think he's one of those guys that, you know, as they're have kind of really well into the rebuild and playing a bit more meaningful games kind of thing, as they say, that he'll be a guy that might be coming in when they're peaking. Brad Marchand, honor roll. Superstar honor roll. Okay, we got a rookie retrospective of Trevor Zegras. A little flashier than last year's uh, design. We got a center of attention of Ryan Johansson. Pretty sure we get that one already, too. I don't know. We got a Young Guns of Alex Vlasic. I don't know a lot about this guy. Um, I'm excited if he's not. I don't think he's playing any games in the NHL this year. Maybe last year. He's down with Rockford. Of the AHL. We're on the home stretch. we got three packs to go in what is box number six. Okay. We got another Young Guns canvas of Caden Korzak. I think we might already. Eh, I don't know. We might have already got that one. Out of the same case. Interesting. All right, what do we got here? We got a Trevor Zegras debut dates. And last card of box number six. We're at the halfway point of our case. What do we got? We've got a superstar honor roll of Jordan Cairo. All right, thanks for watching, guys. That was box 612. Up the Creek Hockey Cards, like, subscribe, comment. Let me know, post pictures of kind of the beasts that you guys have pulled on this opening day. And uh, talk to you later.